Hey everyone, Technometry with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to enable satellite messaging on your iPhone. So let's get started. Now, before you can do that, there are two requirements that you have to meet. First thing is you have to have an iPhone 14 or newer. And the second requirement, it has to be updated to iOS 18 or newer in order to be able to use this feature. So once you have those requirements, you can do this to activate or enable uh, satellite messaging. First thing is you'll pull down the control menu here and it should man up here and then in the middle you press and hold and this these connectivity options will pop up but right down here is satellite option should be available for you. If I click on it right now I don't have the option because I'm connected to a zone where I have either Wi-Fi or cellular connection but in a scenario when you are camping or you're traveling or you're in an area that does not have Wi-Fi or cellular connection this option will be, you'll be able to click on it to turn that feature on so you can use the satellite one. Now along with that, another setting to check out on how to actually point your phone to enable satellite if it doesn't show up is by going into your settings and then scroll the way down to apps and then you're going to look for the messages app right here. Then under the messages app, you want to ensure that you have iMessage of course turned on and then if you go down a little bit further, messages via satellite, you see a section right here where you can use iMessage and text message when cellular and Wi-Fi are not available. You can here show you a demo how that's done. So as you can see your messages via satellite. If I can click on it, I can do a test connection demonstration. I'll just turn off my cellular here. And then what you'll need to do is get into a clear view of sky. I'm in a building right now, so that's going to be blocking connections. But essentially, if you're in a train or somewhere, it's blocked you'll have to wait. Right now it says next satellite available in four minutes, not connected. Sometimes it does happen where the connection you do have to wait. This is a new feature of course that's coming on so it's still there are some things going on with it. I think Apple is still working on to figure out exactly how to make it more stable but generally it will ask you to point your phone either way depending on where the satellite shows up which we demonstrate in another video on how to connect your iPhone to a satellite. But once you're connected you'll be able to just use your message like normally you can send your messages to your contact and it sh you should also be able to receive it as well. So that's how you enable or activate again satellite messaging on your iPhone. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for iPhone and other iOS devices. We'll see you guys next time.